All right, y'all, I got one for you here. I just got a call here yesterday, and this is something that people really need to know, right? One of the first things you have to do before you go out and purchase a truck is get an insurance quote to know if you can even get insurance, right? I got a guy called me. He just got him a driver. He's not planning on driving the truck. Today, as I'm making this video right now, Saturday, he's looking at a truck, right? His driver has only been driving for four months. So like I asked, or like I told him, before you purchase that truck, get a VIN number from that truck or go online, get a VIN number from any truck, dissimilar to what you're thinking about purchasing in your price range, whatever it is, right? Call an insurance company, give him, give them that VIN number, give them the driver's CDL information, name as it appears on their driver's license. See if you can get insured for that truck. See if they would insure that driver. You need to do this before you buy the truck, right? Do that before you buy the truck. Because if you can't get insurance, you got a truck that you can't insure, you can't use that truck, right? So this is, this is simple. This is something that don't cost you anything to do, right? So you need to do that first. Another thing is my insurance company, this is just an example. My insurance company would not cover anyone that's not 25 years old and that they hadn't had the CDL for at least two years. That's, it's not the same with every company. Some companies will insure you if you don't haven't had your CDL for two years, but they may charge an amount that's not beneficial to you, right? You may just be in business to pay that insurance company. You need to know exactly what it's going to cost you to insure your driver and insure your truck. You need to know this before you buy the truck. The same guy has a friend that, that's already purchased the truck. She doesn't even know this. He said he's going to call her after he got off the phone with me because she already got her truck. She don't have a driver, right? She don't even have insurance, so I'm assuming she paid cash for her truck, right? But she don't even know if she can insure that truck or insure a driver because she's not going to drive. She's looking for a driver. So these are just some things that you guys need to know before you go out here and get stuck with these trucks. And we'll give your boy a couple of likes and, and subscribe to me. I got something for y'all out here. You know, I'm going to lace y'all up out here on this trucking thing. But anyway, you need to know this before you purchase these trucks because you, you, can, you can get out here and get stuck. I know a guy that got out here and he's driving now. One truck, he doesn't even have a trailer. He just got the, the, uh, a sleeper. This guy insurance is so high. When I pay for five trucks and three trailers, this guy paid almost that for one truck. So the, it's not even worth him being in business. He didn't know that until he got in here. Peace.